You know, I think companies have become over-reliant and even slightly addicted on using feedback as a mechanism for making decisions. Consider how many times have you been asked to provide feedback on another executive or a member of your team, maybe through some sort of a 360 tool or some sort of a survey, or even think about our own kids. How many times do you see them upset about the fact that they weren't liked by other friends in their school? Feedback is this new addiction. And I think that it is important, don't get me wrong, that we need to provide each other feedback. It is the area by which we can provide that light in the darkness of a blind spot. And blind spots are very, very dangerous if we don't see what's hidden. So feedback is extremely important for that. However, I think it's at the expense sometimes for being able to make a decision. We can spread all of the decision to so many different people when we involve them in a bunch of surveys where we're collecting their feedback. Sometimes you might be a great eater, but you're not necessarily a great cook. Ergo, we need to be able to trust and create a direction for our company and, and stay uh, strong in our commitment. That might mean once in a while we have some people that don't fully agree, but we should be able to trust the certain people to be able to make some decisions from their perch to be able to take us forward. We need to we have that kind of character of self and of leadership to be able to know the direction we need to take without necessarily watering all of our decisions down based on the aggregate average score of all of the feedback we've we'll collected from everybody. So ergo, we need feedback. Please know that I think that's important, but let's not have feedback be the replacement for our direction, our purpose, and our character as leaders.